What is going on, everybody? I hope you're having an amazing morning, afternoon, or evening, depending on wherever you're tuning in in the world. My name is EQ, and today we're going to be going over Block Dag, which is probably one of the most popular projects that's out right now. And it's so new that if you try to go look it up on Coin Market Cap, it doesn't necessarily exist yet because they are still in pre sale. So all you're going to see is news and about, but you're not going to see any charts or anything that you would typically see on these uh, cryptocurrency ratings and stuff like that. Now, BlockDAG is essentially taking the best components of a lot of projects like Bitcoin, Caspa, as well as taking concepts from the IoT or Internet of Things projects as well. And what really makes this a standout project is that you can mine this directly from your phone for free, as well as buying other miners, and we'll get into that. Now, BlockDAG is a layer one proof of work solution, so it's going to be similar to Bitcoin. And then in the sense of it being a DAG, it's going to be like Caspa, which is another very popular project. And to get into really quickly what a DAG is and what it stands for, it's a directed acyclic graph. And what you can see here, I'll, I'll explain it as simple as possible. In a blockchain, every transaction is just going to go block by block, and that's why it would be called a blockchain. Whereas the directed acyclic graph, you're going to get transactions moving in all sorts of different directions. These are all different nodes. All of these nodes have equal strength. And based on the size of the community, it will dictate how fast the transactions are moving. As well, the as well as the security and responsiveness, because at the end of the day, this would be the most decentralized version of a blockchain. So BlockDAG is going to be taking the best of both. You're still going to get some of the benefits of being a blockchain, and you're going to get the benefits and the utility of being a DAG. Because a big thing to remember and the big difference between something like this and Bitcoin is that I would consider Bitcoin a dinosaur. And what that means is that as a asset, as a, let's say, a gold comparison, it's great. But as a utility, it's not that good. They've had to try to add things like the lightning updates and stuff like that. But at the end of the day, the blockchain wasn't built for utility and to be skilled on top of. So that's where something like BlockDAG can come in because it is a DAG. So it does allow you to maintain that proof of work mechanism and consensus that people like so that you can still mine the crypto. And at the same time, you get the utility as in a comparison to something like Ethereum, where the layer twos and layer threes can be built on top of the blockchain and really start to complement BlockDAG overall. Now, right off the bat, when you go to their website, you can see the first thing is gonna be the BlockDAG dashboard. So we'll take a look at that first. When you go on the dashboard, the first thing you'll be able to do is buy some of these BlockDAG tokens in the presale. And at the same time, you can see that they do have miners that you can purchase with ETH, USDT, BNB, and it'll give you different rewards. You can see the ROI cal uh, calculator, mining profit, and the price right now is 014, so we can move the slider to the 014 and get accurate prices. So if you're mining from the phone, you'll be getting 20 BDAG per day maximum, which is about 28 cents at current price. And then as you go up in miners, you can see the value and see how much you're getting every single day as a maximum as an ROI. So if you were interested in mining DAG, you can always start with the mobile. And if you like what you see, just continue to upgrade and you can buy them directly here. So you can kind of see in comparison, low, medium, high miner, and then the free miner would be the phone. And this is all still pretty basic and in V1. Mind you, they're still in the pre-sale. So you're getting in well before anyone else. And by the way, this video is not sponsored by any way. This is just my personal opinion on the project. And I've seen how much hype is in this in terms of the marketing and I definitely wanted to talk about it just to bring awareness to not only my community but the crypto space so you can get an even opportunity at getting into a project at the ground floor that has the potential of growing to let's say the level of Caspa which is just to meet a relative standard now so far in the pre-sale they've already raised 54 million dollars and this is essentially what the mobile app looks like it's still in test flight mode so it's not working perfectly it's in beta but you do get the option and the ability to start mining block DAG or at least see what it would look like doing it on the phone. And literally all you have to do is sign in and press a button and then leave your phone on. It will essentially act as a node and that's how you would be mining block DAG. And you would be helping the DAG overall because as you remember earlier in the video, each node is going to be given equal strength in a comparison. So by you using this device, you're still going to ping the same amount as someone else. You're just not going to ping as frequently. In comparison to let's say someone that bought the highest level miner that's doing 2000 coins per day versus the 200 that you would get from the phone or sorry the 20 you would get from the phone 
And you always want to see a project that has a lot of dev releases too. They're very open about that. So you can see basically every day they have a different dev release and they go over some of the changes and the things that they do day by day. And this is current too. So it's not like these are year old dev updates. These are from literally a couple days ago. And this is kind of what I was explaining before where speed meets security. It's inspired by Bitcoin and Caspa. So they claim to be the world's most advanced layer one blockchain. You've got a heavy hitter list on the powered by including Adobe, Gemini, Aces, Google, Gmail, Apple Pay, so on and so forth. Always good to see. Now the ways to get blocked out where the core attributes is just being able to buy coins through coin acquisition. You can get coins through mining rigs. You can get coins through mobile mining. And on top of that, you have the fastest proof of work blockchain at 10 blocks per second. And by being a DAG, it's one of the most secure systems that you can get because a DAG is a lot more secure than a typical or standard blockchain would be. Now, as far as the tokenomics go, there's going to be a total of 150 billion coins. 50 billion are being sold in the presale. So it is finite. It is deflationary. Now, just to put it into perspective, Bitcoin is at 21 million coins. So it does have a lot of room for growth, but it's not going to be valued at $60,000 anytime soon. If you're wondering where the rest of the money was going, majority was going to community allocation and then 1% is going to team allocation, which is locked. When you get some time, definitely go through their V2 white paper. It's well in depth, has a lot of information. And it's actually going to go through a lot of the information that I'm talking about and some more of the mathematics that go into how these DAGs actually work. Above all of that, the thing that I find most intriguing about BlockDAG is their marketing scheme. Now, if you follow this channel, you know, and I talk about this a lot, that the marketing will drive the narrative and the narrative will drive the overall mass frenzy and the mass retail purchasing of these projects. So all you have to do is a quick search of BlockDAG and you'll see right off the bat that BlockDAG is being compared to Jasmine and Phantom. Um, they're putting it right next to Toncoin, Ethereum, Solana, Near Protocol as a top five trending project. BlockDAG towers over Shiba Inu and Filecoin. BlockDAG becomes the hottest crypto while Dogecoin recovers and Cosmos advances. So the, every little bit of news that's coming out about this project, they're comparing it with these huge crypto projects in the top hundred, a lot of them, and comparing to say how most people are moving their money to BlockDAG. In, like for example, 50 million record breaker race quickly, BlockDAG dominates over Polygon and Caspa. So knowing that Caspa is a direct competitor, you're gonna put them there and you're gonna compare it to Polygon, which is my favorite project and one of the OGs in the space who I think is probably gonna have one of the best bull runs out of any project. So they're getting compared to a project like that. And another one, Towncoin, Stellar, that everyone is shifting their money to BlockDAG. Is it the new leader? So you can see from a fundamental perspective once this project is actually going and things are moving and people are able to actually take their profit from what they're mining on their phone and so on and so forth because there's other there's been other projects that have tried to do this in the past and they've just been shams some of the ogs in the space might remember pi browser pi browser was the first essentially that tried to come out and say that you can mine crypto from the phone but that was years ago and they still haven't released the ability to sell the tokens so if BlockDAG can allow people to mine from the phone and allow you to actually withdraw those tokens that you're mining from the phone and get money from it, that's a game changer because Pi Browser got so many users from that and you're taking off a huge paywall from allowing anyone in the world to be able to mine your tokens. So if they're able to figure that out, I could easily see this pushing up. And I would do a technical analysis on a chart, but there is no chart to show from BlockDAG because they're still in pre-sale. So this is just very, very, very ground floor. But if you do want to stay up to date, you can always join the Epic trading floor. I'll leave the link in the description below. So feel free to come join our group for a seven day free trial and you'll be able to get access to our discord group, our trading view, buy and sell signals, our academy and a lot of other resources. Now, if you have any questions about BlockDAG, please make sure to drop them in the comments. I'd be more than happy to help or at least try to point you in the best direction. If you're not following, make sure to hit that follow button. And I hope you have an amazing morning, afternoon, or evening, depending on wherever you're tuning in in the world.